For the third time in five seasons, the Clippers and Mavericks will meet in the first round of the NBA playoffs. After meeting in 2020 and 2021, the two teams will run it back for a third installment of an evolving postseason rivalry. And while the team names remain the same, plenty has changed since the last playoff meeting between the teams. For Dallas, everything still starts with Luka Doncic, but he now has a new playoff running mate in Kyrie Irving, who has been playing at an elite level to close the regular season. On the other side, the Clippers still operate around Kawhi Leonard and Paul George, but they'll now have James Harden and Russell Westbrook in the mix. The Clippers got the best of the Mavericks in the previous two playoff meetings. What will happen this time? Dallas is one of the NBA's hottest teams and has the best player in the series in Doncic. This series could follow the script from the Mavericks Conference semi-finals win in 2022. Both teams take care of home court but the best player makes the biggest difference in a decisive game. It helps that Doncic has a history of playing well against LA. Through 18 career games versus Clippers, Doncic is averaging 32.6 points, 8.3 rebounds and 7.4 assists. The only team he has a higher scoring average against is the Pistons. Check back for odds on the first round series between the Mavericks and Clippers. NBA odds will be provided courtesy of BetMGM. If necessary. Fans in the US can watch the NBA playoffs on Sling TV. Sling is the home for avid sports fans offering a range of sports channels so you can always cheer for your favorite teams with channels like ESPN, TBS, TNT, NFL Network, FS1 and more. NBA Mock Draft, where do Donovan Kling and Zach E.D. land after NCAA Tournament? The Clippers and Mavericks met three times during the 2023-24 regular season. LA won the series 2-1. Context is important for these results, especially because Game 1 of the playoffs will come four months after the last meeting between Dallas and LA. Each meeting occurred before the Mavericks' transformative trade deadline in which they added starters P.J. Washington and Daniel Gafford. The first matchup between the two teams was Harden's third in a Clippers uniform, and Westbrook was still in the starting lineup. Dallas took full advantage of LA's dysfunction and cruised to an 18-point win thanks to 44 points, on 17 of 21 shooting, from Doncic. After Westbrook moved to the bench, the Clippers started finding clarity. In LA's win over Dallas on November 25, Westbrook turned in 14 points, 8 rebounds and 7 assists in a reserve role. The win is even more impressive considering Leonard had just 8 points on 2 of 12 shooting. The season series wrapped in Dallas on December 20 with both George and Irving sidelined. With each team down a star, it was Leonard who dominated, scoring 30 points, grabbing 10 rebounds and dishing out 5 assists. Doncic scored 28 points but shot 36, 